Hey everyone, Miles J here, and today I'm going to be reviewing RPG Show's PTS 001 wig. That stands for Potty Tonight, Sun 001. We've conceived, conceived, we've believed, believed, we've achieved, achieved, we've revealed. We will view weave. So this is the box they sent it to me in. Now I know a lot of y'all were not a fan of the kinky hair I got last time. And it's fine, but you know, you need to work on loving yourself more so that way you could love that hair more. But anyway, I decided to switch it up and I decided since so many of y'all wanted to go there in the comments that I would do like a straight lace wig. And this wig is human hair as well and that's why it's probably gonna cost y'all about $306. So... Yeah, it's expensive, but if you are a beginner or you don't like human hair wigs, I would suggest getting a synthetic wig. Synthetic wigs are so much more cheaper because, you know, they're synthetic. Now this wig, as my last one did, comes with another wig cap, a brush, a wooden brush for you to brush your weave out, and a lace wig instruction guide. Now I'm just going to go ahead and assume, since it's the second time around, that they send everybody that. Now, let's put on this wig, this lace friend. Oh, and I also got the um, combs and the adjustable straps because I honestly cannot live without them. So you just pull the straps in or make them loose to fit the size of your dome. Okay, now putting her on, I didn't cut the lace yet or anything. Okay, so right away, something I want to say is I feel like she, she feels a little thin, like if I pull all the hair together, like, like that, like, I don't know. I, I don't know how I feel about that. Like, it feels like there's no hair in here and there's like $306. Like, hunty, hunty, where is her hair? Hunty, please, like, put some more hair in here. All right, so I'm gonna go fix her up. I'll be back. All right, so first I started out by just brushing her out of my face. She was very messy and hard to deal with. So instead I ended up with this cute mustache. Ha ha ha, we big it, ha ha ha. Then I just clipped back the parts of the hair I wasn't going to cut, so that way I didn't accidentally chop off more than I needed to. After that, I just brushed my bangs forward and gathered them in my hand and snip, 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 snipped until I finally got the desired length of my bangs. I use this up snipping motion to create more of a fringe with my bangs so that way it's not just a blunt straight line. And voila, here is what my bangs look like. After I finished cutting the bitch, I just used my straightener to flatten her out because she was going crazy and being frizzy all over the place so I needed her to calm the bug down. Then I just brushed her out and this is the finished look. All right, I'm back and this is what she looks like cut to fit the frame of my face. At least I think so. I might need to do a couple of adjustments, but this is pretty much it. So first things first, I'm the realist. No, first things first, I wanna talk about this hair. Okay, so let me take her down for a minute. All right, so this is how much hair she has. It doesn't feel like a lot, to be perfectly honest, like y'all saw that ponytail. One thing I do like though is that it is really easy for me to flip my hair down, okay, then pull her up and back and situate her in a nice, really, really, really high, nice and cute ponytail. Now, as you can see, I do need some work with that, like with the sides and everything. I just pull the sides down a little bit. And that's why I also gave myself these, so that way it could hide the lace. Because right now, I don't really have lace glue, okay? And it's kind of hard to find in this small ass little town. So, um, I just use these parts of the bangs to hide that part. Um, and yeah, as you can see, it's a pretty high, um, and I can also tie it around in like a bun, if I really felt like it, and hide the back, I don't know. If y'all can see the back, 
or not and you can't really I don't know at least I feel like you can't see the lace at all really um, so that's one thing I really 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 like about this wig because it is super hard to pull off like a high ponytail or a high anything with a wig because of the way the tracks or the hair is put into the wig itself and this is an all lace wig like it's lace all over so that's why I feel like it's a bit easier to do that than with other wigs this lace front and this high ponytail is killing it I like it in the back it has little baby hairs this lace front on the side is impeccable but this ain't got no hair this wig is not gonna last a very long time especially because of this human hair and depending on how much it sheds which we will see about in the future like she's gonna be a bob in no time honey a bob in no time all in all though I'm a little bit disappointed I have to say so I'm just gonna have to give this one disgruntled black girl out of five so with that being said, you can find many, many, many other wigs that have like a bang and are super thick and that are synthetic for a lot less than $306, okay? $300 and you ain't got no hair? Even though it's human hair, you use $300, like, like, ma'am, ma'am, please put some hair in this. Thank you guys so much. I will talk to you guys all later and I hope you enjoyed my weave with you. Bye. Weave with you weave.